This is the uh, Sharn City Council first tier favor and saga reward. So we get plus two to bluff and haggle, always good things for the first reward. And then for the saga, it's gonna be this one, the heroic masterminds of Sharn Saga. And we get the hard reward and for running on hard, I, uh, again, if you want to get, you can run the run normal separately for the whole chain, then hard separately for the whole chain to get two saga rewards. I did this because I thought it would make more sense for the video series. And so my choice here are um, two plus one skill tomes, move silently and concentration, neither of them which are really huge priorities for me. 22,000 experience, which uh, if I'm gonna take, I'll take that after I get Epic Destinies. And then we have these four materials down here. So um, generally, if 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 you're going to take these, uh, there are, I mean, if you have a bunch built up, then you might want to take these. If you, you're short on these, but you have a bunch of these. But generally, uh, the materials that we get uh, from the, from the, uh, you know, in our bag, you'll notice these are not in there. So the way it works is there's like a crafting station where, let me open up my bag. There's a crafting station where you where you turn these into these these materials. Then you turn these materials into these materials. So these are the top tier materials. And if you want to rank these in terms of, uh, if you want to rank these in terms of, you know, material cost, you'd want to take either the caustic compound or the stabilizing compound for sure, especially if you don't have any. Uh, I'm going to just pause it and go over to the crafting station and just take a look at the um, options and we'll see like how many use stabilizing and how many use caustic and whether one is better than the other. Uh, my theory is that no, they're probably about the same, but I'm going to just pause it, go over to the crafting station and we'll take a look. So uh, my priority would probably be constitution. Uh, my hit points are, I would say probably average for the level. Um, they could be better. I do have I do have like my 20 vitality gem and I have a hit point gem and I, I have some things, you know, an okay constitution, a little low. So I'd say 500 is about right. And when I fl swap on my vitality item, I'm over 500. Um, but I'd like to go higher. So, you know, I'd probably take a look at, you know, add constitution. And so it's using a stabilizing compound, right? For all the various different options. Now, I don't have the item, so that's why it's giving me this uh, item, right? So, so it looks like st stabilizing compound looks like what's used for constitution. And insightful constitution is also stabilizing compound. Quality constitution is also stabilizing compound. And if I look at strength... I don't know what these ones with the threads of fate are. I'm gonna have to take a look at that. That might be for a different series, but strength is also stabilizing compound. So it looks like, at least for us, let's see what's that. Caustic compound for some of them, but I'm seeing a lot of stabilizing compound more than I'm seeing for, for what we know. Here's caustic for quality strength. So um, it's pretty neutral, but you know, I'd say stabilizing looks a little a little better, so I'm gonna just pause it and head back to the reward. And so, um, you know, if I'm gonna take the mats, it's either gonna be stabilizing or caustic, and I'll probably take stabilizing, and then uh, I'll probably bank my next saga until I'm ready to, you know, the, the heroic elite saga, until I'm ready to make an item, but I have to take this to open it up for the elite saga, and I could wait, I don't have to, I'm not gonna run elite, until I get my Epic Destinies. But I'm pretty sure I'll take that over the experience because I want to make a level 15 gear set. And this is, uh, probably Sharn is the best gear for level 15. And I want to make sure I get that gear set before August 31st in case I don't have enough points by August 31st to buy uh, Sharn yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this. And then that resets, also resets the Saga. 
and so I'll run all these again when I run all these on elite I'll get the chance to get another saga reward uh, but we're not done because I also have a heroic saga for the cogs quest these are the wilderness quests and um, a few a, a few of these I haven't run as much as the others the six I've run quite a bit and then the, the last two I'm gonna run I haven't run as much I've skipped them a lot of times but now I want to run them for the saga uh, so that's gonna be next up is gonna be these so that's the Sharn uh, favor reward for first tier and the saga reward for the for the uh, chain in this in Sharn itself.